The overall goal of this procedure is to measure fatigue-like behavior in mice to establish a fatigue model and test whether intervention can reverse the fatigue. This method can help answer key questions relating to fatigue, such as what interventions can help reduce fatigue or reverse fatigue models. The main advantage of this technique is that it can quickly assess fatigue-like behavior and or anti-fatigue interventions with a single piece of hardware. Visual demonstration of this method is critical. It is important to see and understand how the mice behave in order to successfully perform this task. Prior to training and testing mice, ensure that the treadmill is on a flat surface and set it to the desired angle of inclination which is usually 10 degrees. Next, ensure that the electric shock frequency and intensity are set appropriately, which is usually to 2 Hz and 1.22 milliamps. Under the treadmill, place a piece of paper or an absorbent pad to collect feces and urine. Then, place a pad over one third of the treadmill housing furthest from the shock grid to create a darkened space and entice the mice to stay in that area. Now, proceed with training the mice. With the treadmill off and the speed set to zero, quickly load the mice, holding them by their tails, directly onto the treadmill belt. After placing each mouse, Promptly turn on its corresponding shock.